it would be a down payment. The turning point could be moving from 191 Bank Street, all thanks to a $115,000 grant from the University of Vermont Medical Center. This is a matching grant, so I have to raise, or the board and I have to raise another $115,000 to, um, to actually receive the monies. That means $230,000 to purchase a new site for the recovery center. We've gotten to the point in this space where we have to actually tell people when they want to start a group that we don't have space for them. The center operates 83 hours a week, holding more than 150 meetings and workshops a month, all geared at helping the more than 2,500 recovering addicts who come in the door. They have until September to raise the money and next spring to purchase the new space. Today it's the opiate crisis, but addiction issues and helping people move from actively using to being in recovery is something that we're going to have to look at for forever and to have a place that's safe and drug-free in town for people to use and help build their recovery capital I think is absolutely critical.